I love that. Heading out to a preg test today. I've never been on this side of Calgary. We're in like the prettiest area, which is south of Calgary. It's like, you see this place? It's beautiful. It's a forest. I, I wasn't even sure if I was gonna vlog today, but this, this place is amazing. So I have 15 cows to preg test here this afternoon, so it shouldn't be too long a call. It, uh, this is my first call of, a, of like a, I would say a family that's a fan of the cow vet vlogs. So I'm pretty interested to see. They got some kids that are coming back from school a little early so I can teach them how to give injections after we're done the prank test. And I'm very excited. Man, this place is so nice. So nice. Deanna was just talking about these beautiful custom ear tapes. Yeah, that size, I don't know, the bigger size is seven bucks. Yeah, I love that. Okay, you guys, you gotta prank test for me. <laughs> oh. The end of the week. I'm pregnant. Yep. So there's baby's liver right there. This looks like a herker cat. Is that right? <laughs> I can't see if I'm getting anything in the sun, but whatever, it'll be good. Thank you for having me out. Some stuff I'd like the kids to learn about is like the new protocols for uh, pain management. Yeah, absolutely. And stuff like that. I think that's and and even like vaccination protocol and why we're vaccinating. Yeah. Well, and that heart failure one was really interesting. Like once you see it and you're explaining all the symptoms, it was yeah. great. <laughs> okay. <laughs> we'll have to send him some ring pops. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure he would love that. Okay, perfect. Thank you so much, guys. Do you need any yep. help carrying anything? I would love if you carried that. Yeah, Thank you so much. I'll finish the call. Just a wonderful afternoon. Some new clients that are avid watchers of the vlog. Uh, they were more than willing to, to let me share their story. Uh, some beautiful show cattle. They do a lot of 4-H. They sell to a lot of 4-H members as well. Long time ranch family in this area. Very, very enjoyable, enjoyable day. And I got smile cookies. And often I don't talk too much about the vlog in itself. Like, I guess I, I use the vlog to tell my story, but I don't want the vlog to always be a part of the story. But I do think sometimes I shy a little bit too far on the other side and don't talk about it at all. Really, it is a part of, of what I do now and, and a very integral part of, of what I do now. I've been doing it for coming on almost a year and and it, it, it has become entwined with everything else that I do in part of my life so I should talk a little bit more about my experiences but that's the perfect example where I show up to a new call and this has happened and been repeated over and over again as I show up to a new call to people that I've never met before and they know me like they actually know me they know my family they know they know Emerson they know Finney they know a lot of my story it's like it's like showing up to a call and they're old friends, they're old clients. That is something that it's, that's impossible to replicate using any sort of other medium or form of communication. Like you just cannot create that level of depth. And, and that's been one thing that's just completely floored me and surprised me is when I do show up at, at somebody that I've never met before. I walk into a room with somebody that I've never be, met before and they've watched some of my videos. They just, there's this depth of relationship that I can, I can connect so well with them as well because all of the icebreaker stuff is gone because they know me, they know me. Did that make sense? I think that made sense.